Okay, welcome back Savages to another video. In this video we're going to be talking about solar powered water fountains. This one is a good little performer. The motor's only very small, but as you can see it gets quite a bit of height on it as well. Uh, the solar panel is only quite small as well. It comes on a stake like that so you can just stick it in the ground and then you can just angle the solar panel accordingly. Okay, let's see what you actually get in the box when you buy this solar fountain pump. So first off, the solar panel, you get two of these with a connection. And on the back of it, you can actually put a stake in there because it'll be going into the ground. So that's one thing. The next thing is the pump itself. Looks small. And these are the specs of the pump. I'll just hold you up to the camera. And it's a fairly lengthy cable and the pump itself has got suction pads on the bottom as well. You also get two stakes in the ground and there's an extension if you want to get it high above. Remember you're going to get two of each item. Uh, you get the fitting screws if you want to mount the uh, panel somewhere. And you also get a selection of adapters which will go onto the end of the pump so you can get the different patterns of sprinklers. So let me just show you what you get. You get one which is just a single sprout so that can just go on there or on the extension like so and that just pops on there. You get this type of uh, hood which can also go on there and you get different caps for that one. So you can get one which comes with multiple holes in it, so you get a, a more spots coming up from it, but it's not as high. You can also get this one, which has got seven holes. This is another one with um, seven holes as well, but this time it's actually a bit wider apart, so it's just the way the holes have been cut out. So yeah, so it's probably the best fountain. I've had a few fountains in the past and they've all failed, not worked, or you need a lot of sunshine. This is probably the best fountain you can get for your money that'll work in climate where it's not always sunny. And I totally recommend this. And I'll leave a link to it in the description below. So originally I had it out like this, but the problem was because of the uh, the reservoir is only quite small, uh, within about a day or two, the water was just um, emptying. So what I've got is this glass dome to fit over the top. So it doesn't matter how windy or whatever the elements are, the water will just hit the top of the uh, the dome and then just go back into the fountain. So there you go, and it looks quite nice as well. So I hope that's given uh, you guys some ideas on how to create your own water fountain based on solar power. Hope you like the video. Subscribe, like, and see you on the next one.